Hello, dear seekers of the mysterious and the unexplained. Have you ever felt the solid ground beneath your feet and pondered what secrets it might conceal? Dare to join me as we delve into the lore of our planet, not by looking to the stars, but by peering into the depths below our very feet. Imagine, if you will, a world within a world where entire civilizations thrive in the belly of the earth, shielded from the sun's rays and the scrutiny of surface dwellers. This is the realm of the hollow earth theory, a vision of our planet that is as fascinating as it is controversial. Let us embark on a profound journey into the cavernous heart of this enduring enigma. What if I were to tell you that our ancestors believed in vast subterranean networks inhabited by distinct races and fantastical creatures? What if beneath the crust we tread upon, there lay expanses as broad and diverse as the continents above? Such questions fan the flames of our curiosity, beckoning us toward the allure of the unknown. The hollow earth theory posits that the earth is not a dense sphere of molten rock and metal, but rather a shell with significant space inside. It is here, in this inner sanctuary, that legends speak of advanced civilizations and ecosystems paralleling the surface world. These stories, blending folklore with speculative thought, traverse the boundary between myth and possibility, challenging our understanding of the Earth's structure and the limits of human civilization. Throughout history, figures like Edmund Halley, John Cleves Sims Jr., and even Adolf Hitler have been associated with the hollow earth theory, each contributing to its mythos. Halley, renowned for his comet discovery, speculated about concentric shells and luminous atmospheres within the earth. Sims passionately advocated for expeditions to find the polar openings he believed led to the inner world. Their ideas, while scientifically disputed, have left an indelible mark on the human imagination. The concept of a subterranean realm is not merely a Western fancy. From the ancient Greek tales of Hades to the Buddhist Shambhala, cultures across the globe have envisioned underworlds replete with their own lore and significance. These tales often reflect a deep-seated human yearning to uncover what lies beyond the visible, tangible world. Let's consider the ethical implications of such a theory. Imagine a hidden civilization beneath our feet, with its own culture, ethics, and rights. If such a place were to be discovered, what responsibility would we have to its inhabitants? The hollow earth theory, while unproven, poses serious questions about human stewardship, exploration, and the potential consequences of encountering new societies. In our cultural expressions, we find echoes of these subterranean worlds. Jules Verne's Journey to the Center of the Earth is perhaps the most famous literary work that explores this notion. Cinematic portrayals continue to fascinate us with the idea that there are realms just beyond our reach that are waiting to be discovered, or perhaps best left untouched. In modern discourse, the hollow earth remains a subject of intrigue. Though science does not support the theory, it persists in popular culture and conspiracy circles, symbolizing the human attraction to the mysterious and the unexplored. Some argue that governmental secrecy and the pursuit of ancient wisdom keep the theory alive, while others see it as a relic of a bygone era of exploration. The relevance of the hollow earth theory today lies in its ability to inspire us to look beyond our current understanding, to question, and to imagine. It serves as a reminder that our planet is still full of wonders to be explained and that the thirst for knowledge is a fundamental part of the human experience. As we bring our exploration to a close, let us ponder this. How much do we truly know about the world beneath us? What other mysteries might be hidden just out of sight, waiting for the light of our curiosity to reveal them? I thank you for joining me on this thought-provoking journey. I encourage you to continue pondering the possibilities. What if subterranean worlds did exist? How would that reshape our view of our own world? Let the conversation continue in the comments below. Let us know your thoughts, theories, and questions.
Until we meet again, keep the spirit of inquiry alive within you. Chase after the enigmas that stir your soul and never cease to wonder at the vast tapestry of existence that surrounds us. Farewell, and may your intellectual adventures be as boundless as the fabled caverns of the hollow earth.